Incest is routinely overlooked when addressing sexual assault awareness and prevention. Incest that begins at a young age and continues for protracted periods often results in avoidance-based coping skills which form the foundation of present and future interpersonal interactions. More than any other type of child abuse, incest is associated with secrecy, betrayal, powerlessness, guilt, conflicted loyalty, fear of reprisal, shame, self-blame, to name a few. As a form of abuse, it is highly damaging to a child's psyche and most often results in prolonged post-traumatic stress disorder. It took us nearly a year to finally find a spot to speak with you on incest. So what is incest? We define incest as usually socially prohibited. Samaj ijazat nahi deta, legally challengeable, sexual relationships. Law bhi ijazat nahi deta. These include just close blood relationships. Now this is one clarification I want to share with you. This is immediate relationships, for example, me, my parents, my grandparents, my children, grandchildren, my brother or sister, my siblings, my half-brother or half-sister, if one of my parents has remarried, my uncle and aunt, taya, chacha, mama, masi, immediate relationships. The kind of activities include, but are not limited to, fleshing, dikha ke bhag jana, petting, bina ijazat haat lagana, touching, pata hai, phir bhi haat lagana, caressing, sehlana, Kissing, molesting, and intercourse. Please be very clear that just because it is not rape, it is not intercourse, it is not incest, no. Someone touches you within your close relationships, makes you uncomfortable, that's not done. It is all about, then generally, the next question uh, I have been asked is, hota kaise hai? So it is all about someone availing the opportunity to sexually exploit using his or her relationship in the family, using the power and position in the family, to exploit the innocence and ignorance of the young and the dependence of the others. Mokka parasti, chota sa lafs hai, ye bohat zada paya jata hai. It does have some biological evidence also, but majorly it is an opportunity. Ye kabhi nahi sochna ki ye sirf ek religion mein hota hai ya ye sirf unke paas hota hai. Akhbaro mein generally jo news aap ko milti hai that is from lower socio-economic backgrounds only because they are the ones which are reported. Just because it is not reported does not mean it doesn't happen elsewhere. Research says that the most vulnerable age for us to become a victim is 7 to 18 years. All victims are not females. We have females who are victimizing their own family members. 40% of the respondents have said that they are a witness. Mere saath nahi hua, par mujhe pata hai kisi ke saath hua. 40%. 18% said, mere khud ke saath hua. So if there is a victim in every other household, we are also looking at an abuser. They are all around us, they look very normal. They don't have horns, they don't have a tail, they don't have a dagger in their hand. They come very affectionately, very loving most of the times. 92% have said that they were never able to share their trauma with anyone because we feel that nobody will believe us. We can't do anything about the generation that has gone by. Can we become the generation that is open to everyone around us? I hope so. I'm sure uh, many of you would uh, already know some of the signs and symptoms of incest, just like other uh, problems or uh, that happen in life. Incest or child abuse does not always lead to problems when you grow up, but it depends on whether the abuse has been going on continuously for a long period of time, depends on the age of the person, depends on the degree of abuse. And, you know, it's interesting, but it's even been seen that it depends on your genetics. So there are certain uh, people are more predisposed to develop 
uh, signs and symptoms or maybe anxiety or depression or PTSD and certain people are maybe not. Psychological and behavioral signs can be many and uh, so some of them are like depression can happen and in young people when depression happens it's not it may not be that typical so it may be uh, a lot of parents and family members or teachers also may not pick it up because it is it may not be the typical signs and symptoms of depression often young people or children become oppositional and they start becoming aggressive or they have anger outbursts or sometimes they may be social withdrawal they may have a fall in grades they may have conduct problems and there may be irritability they may express it through eating disorders anorexia or binge eating may be there there may be a lot of attention seeking cutting self-harm behaviors may be there mood swings bed wetting also if it starts later on when a child has already first attained toilet training and is no longer bedwetting but if after a number of years bedwetting starts that also may be a sign then the signs and symptoms of post traumatic stress disorder nightmares flashbacks and uh, you know uh, anxiety palpitations so all those signs and symptoms can happen along with this dissociation is a common disorder that, and it can also have cognitive symptoms like poor concentration and poor memory and it can have physical symptoms like anxiety palpitations uh, headache abdominal problems chest pain or just general fatigue aches and pains so all these kind of problems can also happen in uh, children who undergo incest abuse how to speak to a victim is very important it's important to tell them i believe you it took a lot of courage to say this it's not your fault you didn't do anything to deserve this you're not alone i care about you and i'm here to listen or help in any way i'm sorry this happened you're not responsible for what happened to you is there any way i can help you avoid reacting with disbelief avoid saying that why didn't you tell me earlier avoid saying that you know you could have avoided it you should have known better so don't trivialize it who is a who is a child as per law a person who is below the age of 18 is a juvenile aap juvenile ko chhod do apni bhasha mein usko kahoge to usko hum bachcha kahenge to jab hum bachcha word use karte hain that has nothing to do with your gender nothing to do with your sex it is applicable for both girls and boys aisa kya zarurat pad gayi ke bacche hain to bachchon ko bhi kanoon ki madad chahiye ji mummy papa hai na baithe hue bachchon ki raksha ke liye bhai behan baithe hain chacha taaya baithe hain unko kya zarurat hai kanoon mein jaane ki पुलिस में जाने की क्योंकि ये जो बात मैडम कर रहे हैं इंसेस्ट की ये जो सेक्सुअल अब्यूज की बात कर रहे हैं वो बच्चे के साथ सेक्सुअल अब्यूज कोई बाहर का नहीं कर रहा अपने घर का कर रहा है जिसको वो अपना घर समझ रहा है कि जहां पे वो मैं सबसे ज्यादा सेफ और सुरक्षित हूं तो एक बच्चा जो 18 साल से कम उम्र का है उसको ये बातें अभी समझ नहीं होती हैं कि कौन मेरे बॉडी के साथ किस तरह से बिहेव कर रहा है मगर किन कारणों से वो कर रहा है और किन कारणों से वो उसको रजिस्ट नहीं कर रहा है ये भी मैडम ने बताया आपको कुछ कुछ बातें तो एक कानून स्पेशल बनाया पॉस्को एक्ट पॉस्को एक्ट का मतलब क्या है प्रोटेक्शन ऑफ चिल्ड्रन अगेंस्ट सेक्शुअल अफेंसेस एक बड़ा सिंपल सा लॉ है नो बडी कैन टच योर बॉडी विदाउट योर परमिशन विदाउट योर कंसेंट 
एक डॉक्टर भी आपको टीका नहीं लगा सकता अगर आप खुद डॉक्टर को नहीं कहते हैं तो नो बडी दिस दिस इज सच ए सेक्रोसेंट राइट गिवन टू अस तो वी हैव नॉट टू वी आर नॉट टू अलाउ एनी बडी टू टच आर बॉडी वो जो पिंक नो मीन्स नो जो मैडम बात कर रहे हैं जो कि वो इंसेस्ट नहीं है तो इंसेस्ट वाले स्टेज में जब बच्चे हैं उनको नो मीन्स नो कहना नहीं आता इस सारी स्टोरी में दो लोग हैं एक जो गलत काम करने वाला और दूसरा कौन है विक्टम और दोनों को डील करने के लिए एक्ट बन गया बच्चों के लिए एक एक्ट बन गया बड़ों के लिए बड़ों के लिए एक अलग एक्ट है वो ऑलरेडी एग्जिस्टेंस है जिसको हम कहते हैं इंडियन पिनल कोड इंडियन कोई भी क्रिमिनल एक्ट करेगा तो उसके अनुसार उसको सजा मिलेगी फर्स्ट स्पोर्ट सिस्टम हैज कम फ्रॉम द पुलिस व्हेन समबडी डायल्स हंड्रेड नंबर टू द पुलिस तो ऐसी स्थिति में अगर कभी भी आपको बाहर की सपोर्ट की जरूरत है चाहे आप छोटे बच्चे हैं चाहे बड़े हैं तो सबसे पहले आपने और कुछ नहीं करना है एक सौ नंबर पे टेलीफोन करना है तो मैडम ने अगला क्वेश्चन ये किया कि पुलिस नो भी सेंसिटिव होने की लोड़ है पुलिस वाले तो गाली नहीं सुन दे आई एम सॉरी हंड्रेड नंबर इज मोस्ट इफेक्टिव नंबर इन चंडीगढ़ तो आई विल आस यू टू काइंडली पुट हंड्रेड नंबर एज नंबर वन ऑन योर मोबाइल्स जीरो वन सेवन टू वन जीरो जीरो शुड बी द नंबर वन ऑन योर मोबाइल इन केस ऑफ एनी एमरजेंसी इंक्लूडिंग दिस काइंड ऑफ सिचुएशन प्लीज गिव कॉल टू हंड्रेड नंबर दैट इज द फर्स्ट इंट्रैक्शन विद द लॉ जितनी जल्दी आप ये चीज को रिकोगनाइज करेंगे कि हमारे शरीर के साथ ये गलत हो रहा है एंड मेरे घर का बंदा ये गलत कर रहा है उतनी जल्दी आप इसमें फैसला ले सकेंगे अगर आप उसको ढकते जाएंगे ढकते जाएंगे लेयर्स के ऊपर लेयर्स बनती जाएंगी ना तो स्टेट आपकी कोई मदद करेगी ना ना जज मदद करेगा ना पुलिस मदद करेगी तो कभी भी गलत नो सहन ना करो समझ लो कि गलत की चीज है वो अवेयरनेस थानू होनी चाहिए कि व्हाट इज राइट एंड व्हाट इज रॉन्ग वन एंड व्हाट आर द कॉन्सिक्वेंसिज ऑफ फाइलिंग ए कंप्लेंट एंड कॉन्सिक्वेंसिज ऑफ नॉट फाइलिंग ए कंप्लेंट इफ यू डिसाइड टू फाइल ए कंप्लेंट देन यू हैव टू ट्रेवल ए वेरी लॉन्ग रोड सीकिंग ऑल द सपोर्ट फ्रॉम गवर्नमेंट इंस्टीट्यूशन अगेंस्ट your own very dear near ones who have done something wrong to you and see the day when they are at their right place not in the safe environments of your home which they have polluted by their wrong acts thank you so much